standard first subject maths hello student i am jyoti singh student today we will learn a new topic tally marks 1 to 10 student you already know how to read and write this number from 1 to 10 and how to count it today we will learn in a new way to count this number tally chart tally chart is used to count item in a group of 5 chart is used in showing the information we collect the information by taking examine then we create tally chart tally marks is quick to show how many each tally marks represent one object i will show you how to draw tally marks one standing line represent one tally mark two standing line represent two tally mark three standing line represent three tally mark four standing line represent four tally mark and five cross a line make a group now student i will show you all this one by one number 1 is represented by one standing line number 2 is represented by one two two standing line number 3 is represented by one two three three standing line number 4 is represented by one two three four standing line number 5 is represented by 1 2 3 4 standing line and 5 slanting line it's made a group of 5 number 6 is represented by 1 2 3 4 4 standing line and 1 slant line it make a group of 5 and 1 standing line Number seven is represented by one, two, three, four standing line and one slant line. It's make a group of five and one, two, two standing line. Number eight is represented by one, two, three, four standing line and one slant line. It's make a group of five and one, two. three standing line number 9 is represent by 1 2 3 4 standing line and one slant line it's make a group of 5 and 1 2 3 4 standing line number 10 is represent by 1 2 3 4 standing line and one slant line it's make a group of 5 and 1 2 3 4 four standing line and one slant line it's make a group of 5 student we already know tally mark represent count of object so number 1 represent one tally mark means one apple number 2 represent Two tally marks means one, two, two apples. Number three represent three tally marks means one, two, three apples. Number four represent four tally marks means one, two, three, four apples. Number five represent five tally marks means one, two, three, four, five apples. Number six represent by six tally marks means one, two, three, four, five, six. Six apples. Number seven represent by seven tally marks means one, two, three, four, five, six. 7 7 apples number 
represent by a telemarks means 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 8 apples. Number 9 represent by 9 telemarks means 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. 9 apples. Number 10 represent by 10 telemarks means 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 10 apples. Now student, in this example, count and draw the tally marks for the following. So in first picture we have bees. So let's count how many bees are there. 1, 2, 3. So there are 3 bees. So how many tally marks I will draw? Yes. 1, 2, 3. Now in second example we have leaves. So let's count how many leaves are there. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So there are 5 leaves. So how many tally marks I will draw? Yes. 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5, I will draw cross line to make a group of 5. Now student, in third picture we have doll. So let's count how many dolls are there. 1, 2, 3, 4. So there are 4 dolls. So how many tally marks I will draw? Yes. 1, 2, 3, 4. So I will draw 4 tally marks. Now in 4th picture we have stars. So let's count how many stars are there. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So there are 7 stars. So how many tally marks I will draw? Yes. 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5. I will draw cross line to make a group of 5, 6, 7. So I will draw 7 tally marks. Now in 5th picture we have heart shape. So let's count how many heart shapes are there. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So there are 9 heart shapes. So how many tally marks I will draw? Yes. 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. I will draw cross line to make a group of 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Now student, in this example, count a shape of different color and draw the tally marks of it. So, we have here shapes like square, rectangle, circle and triangle. So, first we will count how many squares are there. 1, 2, 3, 4. Four. So there are four squares. So how many tally marks I will draw? Yes. One, two, three, four. So I will draw four tally marks. Now we will count how many rectangles are there. One, two. So there are two rectangles. So how many tally marks I will draw? Yes. One. Two. So I will draw two tally marks. Now we will count how many circles are there. One, two, 
3. So there are 3 circles. So how many tally marks I will draw? Yes. 1, 2, 3. So I will draw 3 tally marks. Now we will count how many triangles are there. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So there are 6 triangles. Now we will draw tally marks for it. 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5. I will draw cross line to make a group of 5, 6. Now student, in this example we have collection of flowers. Flowers like lily, rose, daisy. So first we will count how many lilies are there. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So there are 6 lilies. So how many tally marks I will draw? Yes. 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5, I will draw cross line to make a group of 5, 6. Now student, we will count how many roses are there. 1, 2, 3, 4. So there are 4 roses. So how many tally marks I will draw? Yes. 1, 2, 3, 4. So I will draw 4 tally marks. Now we will count how many daisies are there. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So there are 5 daisies. So how many tally marks I will draw? Yes. 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5, I will draw cross line to make a group of 5. Now student, look at the picture. In this picture, we have different farm animals. Count the animals, then draw the tally marks and then write the numbers. So student, here we have animals like cow, hen, goat, sheep. So first we will count how many cows are there. 1, 2. So there are 2 cows. So how many tally marks I will draw? Yes. 1, 2. And what will be the number will come here? Yes. 2. Now student we will count number of hen. 1, 2, 3, 4. So there are 4 hand. So how many tally marks I will draw? Yes. 1, 2, 3, 4. And what number will come here? Yes. 4. Now student we will count number of goat. 1, 2, 3. So, there are 3 goat. So, how many tally marks I will draw? Yes. 1, 2, 3. And what number will come here? Yes. 3. Now, student, we will count number of sheep. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So, how many tally marks I will draw? Yes. 1, 2, 3, 4. And 5 line I will draw cross line to make a group of 5. 
And what number will come here? Yes, 5. Now student, activity time. Count the object around your house. Write the number, then draw the tally marks for it. So student, you have to count chairs in your house, people living in your house, TV in your house, and then you have to write number and then draw tally marks. And here you have to count toy in your cupboard, crayons pencil, chocolate in your bag, and you have to write number and then draw tally marks. Now it's your homework time. Count the object in the picture below then write number and draw tally marks. Use tally marks to show how many sports items are in each group. Then circle the number that how many. Thank you.